Uh, I've never seen any bugs come out from under this cap on this tractor. Of course, this runs off diesel. We're going to take that off. Nothing there. Okay. But I have seen on the internet where people have complained of finding bugs in their diesel fuel tank on their tractor. And I'm going to show you how that can happen. If you use your, your storage can like this and just pour it in there like that, you're, you could very well get bugs in your fuel tank. Highly recommend a large funnel like this with a fine screen at the bottom. That'll prevent that. You can prop this up and use that to pour your fuel in. I'm going to show you why these containers are a problem. This is where I store the diesel fuel, away from the buildings out here um, in those yellow containers. I'm gonna get one of them to open it up. See all those bugs? It is strange. Something about this diesel fuel container that they like. This is that last clip, but slowed down considerably in speed. Make it a little easier to see them fall out of that cap. Pretty weird looking little creatures. These things move fast, but I tried to capture one as it fell on the ground. Now we're going to open this gasoline container. Nothing. No bugs. I captured a couple of them and put them on the hood of our truck just to get a better look at them. And that's what these uh, images are right here. Now, my wife and I described them to her. She immediately said they're earwigs. I'd never heard of them myself. She's the most knowledgeable amateur wildlife biologist I know. So I looked it up and she was right. This background noise is due to a major rainstorm going on while I'm trying to record this, but uh, this is information from Wikipedia. These diesel-loving insects are earwigs, just like my wife said. What's particularly interesting to me um, is that there is a popular uh, thought that the name earwig came from an old wise tale that they burrowed into the brains of humans through the ear and laid their eggs there. Pretty gross, huh? Well, earwigs are not known to purposely climb into ear canals. There have been reports of them being found in the ear. Now, they do find their way in the little crevices. That's probably why they're getting into those uh, diesel fuel cans. They, For some reason, they don't go underneath them. They go up there around where all the diesel odor is. Okay, what did we learn? Well, use a fuel funnel with a fine mesh screen for refueling your tractor. That's just good common sense. If you would like to find an earwig, get a yellow five-gallon diesel fuel container. Fill it with diesel and put it out in the shade somewhere in your yard. Just in case there is something to the airwigs entering the air and eating the brain, try not to fall asleep on your tractor or near yellow five-gallon diesel fuel containers. Hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please like the video, subscribe, and check out our other links to our other videos. We'd really appreciate it. Thank you.